Hello and welcome back to the channel. I am the Whites here playing some more Planet Crafter today. I hope you are well. I'm having a really good day today and we are looking at 2.99% now towards getting lakes um, now that we have liquid water. And that's the liquid water's enabled us to be able to get to the Osmium, which we've got our little um, ore extractor going over there. We've also managed to get the bio lab, which is through here, um, all the way through here. Um, did want to put this somewhere closer to the, the start to be able to craft some of this stuff, um, but unfortunately <clears throat> that's not happened. We're going to need algae for quite a lot of this. Um, the fertilizer needs algae, explosive powder just needs iridium and sulfur. Um, and then uh, we've got mutagens as well. Um, now sulfur, we found, the only sulfur we've found so far has been up in that cave. Um, and I'm wondering if we put an ore extractor up there, is that going to give us more sulfur? Because it looks like we're going to need a fair amount of it. Um, and fertilizer. So I've got another couple of food growers here, which I placed um, in between episodes, and um, we've added a squash because that's in one of the recipes as well, um, and and mushrooms as well. So I added an extra two, and I moved them all out of out here as well. We've now got oxygen in this one, water in this one, and food stuffs in this. We've got quite a lot of eggplants already. Um, we'll be eating space food and beans probably. Um, but I'd like to get some more some more food growers and we can just line them up in here along with veg tubes and other things. We've got space over here as well so um, yeah we're gonna have to probably get quite a lot of this stuff ready for the um, bio lab. So that's the first thing. Um, I did find some more aluminium as well. We looked we went back to the wreck that's over there. Um, quickly there's the ore extractor as well and I did find a bunch of aluminium so looking in here we've not built this launch platform and I think we should do that so we actually need three super alloy um, so let's grab the stuff let's start with this one two three one two three one two three so that should be super alloy it would be great if we could link these containers to this and then we wouldn't have to go into each box but one two three one two three so that's enough for the launch platform right let's go outside and see how big this is um as you can imagine it's huge um i think actually before we do that that takes 55 energy we could be setting ourselves up for a massive problem here. Okay, so we actually are going to need um, 18 more. Uh, what does that provide? Oh, well, it's only one solar panel. So let's grab the stuff for that. One of those, one of those. I'm going to need one of those for the gantry another one of those and an aluminium I call it a gantry, it's a foundation grid let's call it what it is, it's a foundation grid now I could probably stack these a little better so they take up less less space, it doesn't really matter where they're positioned I want to kind of put this launch pad over here I think I might pop it here somewhere Oh, I saw green. It's very big and hard to work out where it is. Okay, so if I put that there, how does that look? Low power. Okay, do we massively underestimate that? Okay, well we didn't underestimate it too badly. Um, need one of those. Two of those, one of those, one of those, one of those. Sorry, it's two of those, I think. Okay, we can build another one of those. Might have to move our water collector if we if we have to build any more of these. 
Right, okay, we've got power restored. Now, let's have a look at this. Very cool. Climb. Craft launch platform. Asteroids attracting a rocket. Attracts uranium asteroids. Ah, attracts uranium asteroids. Gives a global heat generation bonus. Okay, so we need the rocket engine and super alloy for that. Magnetic field projection rocket. Attracts iridium asteroids. Gives a global generation bonus by protecting the magnetic field. Pressure multiplier 1000%. Heat multiplier 1000%. Okay, wow. So we need to get into rocket engines now. Okay. Oh, yeah, I can see my house from here. So yeah, let's go and check on our ore extractor. Oh, I think I just uh, jumped off the bit that I wasn't meant to jump off of. Okay, let's go and check our ore extractor, see if we've got any more aluminium because we could get into uh, the super alloy stuff now. But if we can cause uranium showers and get another nuke reactor going, that'd be awesome. I also want to actually build a proper bridge across here or something because yeah, having to jump down and jump up. I know it's no real big one, but... Okay, we've got one aluminium in there. That's a shame. I was hoping for slightly more. Um, yeah, if we could put a straight... ...bridge, maybe, across here. Can we? We can't build into the rocks, can we? No. Damn it. That's a shame. Looks like we can't build that bridge then. Never mind. Um, actually, we probably can, it's just we won't be able to intersect with these rocks at all. Um, such is the way the building is done in this game, but... Yeah, I like that position there for the launch pad. Um, I think we do need to get the uranium showers on the go. Let's run in here, we're going to need water as well, that's now in here. Perfect. Um, Got one aluminium there. <clears throat> We're running out of all sorts of stuff in there. So I think we might need to go and do a mineral run. However, I think also we should. I want to. Oh, I've just gone out the wrong door. I had to run all the way around. Um, I do want to go because some of these wrecks over here are salvageable and I think in amongst this stack over here there might be some more boxes and things so I just want to go over here and have a little look there's also another way up there um, we've got a couple of halfway houses over there and then there's that big structure so I think we're gonna go and do some wreck hunting um, let's get my torch on and my deconstruction here let's just uh, we take these ones down doesn't look like it um, hello. Thank you very much. That's iron. Um, I'm just going to run in here. I'm also going to just make sure I've got oxygen, which I have. We're going to look for aluminium. There seems to be a fair amount in here, actually. I did just see another one around here. Two around here. Nice. Yeah, if we can get into the super alloy stuff now. I just want to go back so I remember where we are. Reference points, reference points. Don't want to get lost. And I did see another aluminium up here. In fact, there's two up here now. That's great. I want to just run this way and see what's down here and around at the back of this place. Actually, what's up here? Okay, good to know that there's an easy way out right here. But we're looking around for secret stuff that might be hidden, like boxes and more aluminium. Wait, hello there. Oh, wow, super alloy as well. Let's uh, take that box down. Anything up hiding through here at the back? Potential game breaking um, points where we can get stranded. Um, let's have a look around here. More aluminium. 
Ooh. Ooh, hello. I think... So we know that we can build a jetpack. I think we're going to need the jetpack to get up there. Just having a little look around for boxes and things we can get. Uh, wow, we've got plenty of aluminium right now. Okay, so... Yeah, I wonder... We could potentially build a ladder to get up there. Let's see if we can find the stuff here to make a hab unit. Quickly. Um, I need titanium. Do I have a titanium? I don't have a titanium. Right, okay. I have to use one of these. Let's see if we can find a titanium. I bet this is one area where we can't get titanium or something. Let's kind of have a little look over here. This looks like titanium. Yeah, I wonder if we can make a little ladder system without having to build the jetpack. I mean, we are going to build the jetpack. I'm just impatient. Yeah, let's bung this directly there. Yeah, I bet you can't run up that. I need another titanium for the door. So there's a couple of titaniums right here. Alright, let's build a little door. At least then we know we can come back here. We don't have to worry about oxygen too much. Uh -huh. Door on the front. Let's just top that up. Is that iron or titanium? That's iron. So, if we now get some stairs... I mean, I'm trying to cheese this completely. And we get some more stairs. Can I build stairs on the top of this? Whoops. I'd imagine you can. And we put them... There. That's still a way in there. Can I build more stairs? And if so, can I put them on the top of this one? Are we cheese in the game here? Can I jump up here? We can. Okay, I have cheesed the game. Perfect. Alright, what's in you? Yep, 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 yep. I'll take it all. Thank you very much. Um. Oh, wow. Okay, and there's a way across there onto the top as well. So there's going to be stuff over there, isn't there? There's boxes. There's loads of boxes. There's another chip in there. Um, oh yikes, there's loads of stuff in there. Come on, let me through. What's in this? Beans, more super alloy. There's the iron from the wreck. Um, a new blueprint, tier 5 backpack. Amazing. Right, let's go and build some boxes. Um, where's the way out? This way, wasn't it? Yeah. Ooh. Right, okay, that's very cheaty. Um, let's eat some food. Um, let's build a couple of boxes down here. Uh, no, let's actually build a locker. There we go. We can store pretty much all of this stuff in there. And then we can... Uh, it's dark now, but we're going to go back up in there and grab all the stuff. Uh, is that one to deconstruct as well? It is. Right, let's just get rid of all of that. We'll just systematically go through the building here and grab stuff. Right, did we get everything from in here? We did not. Um, that's not a locker we can use there. Let's take that. Let's get rid of that. Um, 
this here is our way across. We'll do that in the morning when it's light. Um, this one, let's grab all of that. Deconstruct that box. And I have one slot left here. Where was that iron that was rolling around in here? Let's grab that. And then we'll head woo, down to our base here. Um, and chuck all of the stuff in there. We are going to need more locker storage. Um, also going to need water, which we have some. So, 400%. Nice. And more mushroom seeds, which is great. Uh, and also a bioplastic nugget, which, which we're able to make now in the bio lab. So that's going to take off some of the uh, stress of um, having to make that later on. We're going to have we're going to have one of those already. Right, let's grab all of this. There's no more. Oh, there is a little guy in here. Look, I forgot about you. That's why we get rid of the boxes when we loot them because we can see which ones we've done and which ones we haven't done. Right, so that's done now. This one here just goes outside. I wonder if there's boxes and stuff hidden around here. I'd imagine there is if there's this walkway. Mind you, the walkway seems to be accessible from everywhere. Let's go and have a little look, shall we? Uh, hello. There's super alloy here, just lying around. Is that? Ooh. Is that commonplace up here? I mean, if it is, hydration level. There's more super alloy here. There's more over there. Oh god. There's more over here as well. Let's have a little drink. Uh, I've got one oxygen canister on me, so I'm going to explore a little bit more. There's, there's super alloy all the way along here. We want all of it. What's through there? Is there a little secret in here? No. Looks like secret. You're getting stuck and then death. Perfect, perfect storm. Okay, I think we're gonna have to come back here. Okay, nothing over this side. I can't see anything around there. Oh. No, oh god. Okay, that's getting a bit thin. Uh, maybe we shouldn't have jumped this. Uh. Okay, let's see about our way around here. Okay, we're going to jump this way. Inventory is full. Well, we're going to get rid of the stuff we don't really need right now. Um, because that's what I want. I don't see anything around there. Let's jump this way. level low, that's fine. I say it's fine, it's... We've got one canister here, so we'll get... Um, can we jump this bit? Oh no! Oh no! Oh, huh? Are we safe? Okay, we've, we've survived. Okay, so there's a few more... There's a few more super alloy up the top there. Let's go back to our makeshift um, cheesy base over here. I've just seen another aluminium just there. Um, and grab all the good stuff. We've got so much stuff here. Um, uh, huh. So don't need that or that. That's basic, that's basic. This is basic. 
don't really want that right now. I want uranium because we're going to need to get another new font line. What have we got in here? We've got more uranium. Um, we're going to need aluminium, aren't we, as well? Let's keep the food back here. That's a bit low grade. We'd like that one instead. Um, I do want the mushroom seeds. I'm going to have to leave some of this. Um, and I do want the uranium as well, because I want to be able to get another uranium rod made so we can have nuclear power. Right, I'm going to grab this, take this back. Um, yeah. Right, let's go. Now, I think the easiest way to get through this maze would be to head out first chance we get and then head around. So that's what I'm going to do here, and I think that's I saw some aluminium up this way somewhere. Wow, look at this rain now. That's kind of cool. Right, there's our base right there. Okay, so run around the outside and we'll basically find our stash. So let's run this back, see if we can make another nuclear reactor. And then um, I think we're probably at the phase where we can actually make the jetpack now. And that's going to be super fun, if not terrifyingly dangerous. Okay, safe, safe and sound. Um, now, we didn't really have a place to put Super Alloy, um, so I think we're going to stick it in here. So much. So good. Right, let's pop this in here. Put seeds, which we'll stick in here. We've got the aluminium now, actually, to... Um, to put some more of this stuff in place. Um, what's in there? 200%. How about 300%? And 400%. Uh, we've got a blueprint here. Mining speed tier 3. Right, what do we need for that? Is that in here? Silicon, aluminium, super alloy. I'm down with it. Let's do it. Uh, silicon, wasn't it? That's my last piece of silicon. Um, take that out. Let's go in here. Grab that. Pop that back in. Um, yeah, well, tier 5 backpack we also managed to get. That's... Three super alloy and a titanium. Let's make that straight away. Um, wrong one. There we go. How much space do we now have now? Loads. Right, cool. Let's go back and grab all of our stuff. Let's eat one of those. Let's uh, eat one of those. I'm going to go back and grab the rest of everything and then I think what I'm going to have to do is grab some magnesium, silicon and cobalt because we don't have a lot and then we can come back and make some stuff so when that happens I will be right back and uh, we'll, we'll make the next load of stuff be right back Okay guys, and we are back, and I've just left the base metal stuff over there, base elements, um, iron and things like that, and um, bought most of the good stuff back here. Um, we do have 300% uh, here, I think that's better than this one, um, so I can stick that in there, and that's all now running to the best of its ability, we've now got all of this food as well. Um, let's put this in here. We've got fabric over in this one. Uh, we've got a bunch of food, actually fabric in there, and I'm also going to put bioplastic in there as well. <clears throat> Excuse me. 
Um, we've got a load more super alloy in there. We've got. I mean, we're going to fill this chest up now, aren't we? This box right here. So, and this one's full. Um, we've now got too much aluminium. Yeah, you never heard me say that. <clears throat> but we've got too much. Um, I do need to. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Make a uranium rod, so we can get rid of that, and we can make one of those. And I'll just pop that in there. Let's decode this blueprint. An area lamp. Okay. Great. Let's pick all of this veg. And let's go again. We can get into. I think we need lakes for algae, but we've got we've got a good amount of food on the go here, so we can basically eat whenever we like. Let's go and empty our water collector as well. I'm going to go and check um, the ore extractor in a second. But I think we're going to leave that here for this episode. Um, I think we'll build another nuclear reactor though before we log off here. Let's grab that. Two of them. Is it two of them or three of them? Three of them. Uh, two water bottles. And that's, was that it? Yeah, that's it. Okay, let's go out here and we'll put another nuclear reactor down. Um, this one's all nicely on a gantry and stuff. This one I'm just gonna throw down on the floor right here for now let's get some proper clean power going how are we doing for power now we've got 103 kilowatts per hour available so that's good um these numbers now are moving very slowly because they're in the uh, micro kelvin and um this is about to go into millipascals right yeah Okay, and oxygen just keeps on going. Let's go and check our biomass as well. See where we are. Okay, we've got a fair fair way to go for the algae generator. Um, so maybe we'll put some more grass spreaders down. That's uh, down here. Aluminium and the seeds, which we've got loads of. Okay, in between this episode and the next episode, I'm going to go and grab a load of base metals and stuff like that. And I might put some more food growers along here for the stuff we're going to need to make fertilizers and things for later, um, seeing as we have plenty of food to actually eat. Um, yeah, until then, uh, take care of yourselves, guys. Uh, stay safe, and I'll see you around for the uh, next video. Hopefully we might launch a rocket as well. Take care now.